Hi, I'm Andrew Coleman. Um, I'm from Liverpool. I'm a bit of a scouser. OK, Andrew, off you go, son. Now, you might recognise me um, from the ITV show Pop Stars, The Rivals. And I got down to the last 30, and apparently I made Pete Walkman cry, Jerry Halliwell shiver down the spine, and Lou Walsh, he just stared at me and he didn't know what to say. Would she ever doubt the way I feel about her in my heart? You gave me chills. That was lovely. Really Ooh. lovely. Oh. Do you know what? If we didn't put you through, it would be a travesty. We've got to put you through. If it wasn't, if it wasn't for that show, then I wouldn't have met with Robin, so I'm very grateful. I was put on to Andy by one particular musician friend and then by several others and one of them came round and showed me a video of the actual pop stars program that he'd been on singing if tomorrow never comes and I thought oh yes I get this guy I get this guy big time wake up to my world wake up to my world the single is called wake up to my world and it's it's kind of a it explains a lot about me and the way I want people to see me. Brilliant, really good, really good. Voice was great, attitude was great. Fantastic. When I first met Andrew, he was, oh, you might have been just 17, I suppose. And he'd done over 500 gigs. So bringing him into the studio and standing him in front of a microphone was absolutely fine, provided you were prepared to chase him around the room with the microphone. Because um, he just didn't fall into the sort of Stevie Wonder blind man, stick your feet to the ground with blue tack and wave the top half of your body around. It was like the Olympics. Put your hands together for Andrew Coleman! I do a lot of charity work um, because I've been helped a lot in the past by charities. Um, I, see, I can see the advantage of, of charity, you know. I think everyone should be involved in charity work because what goes around comes around and if you help someone they're always going to help you back and that's the way your life should be. Absolutely. You have a fucking huge queue of autograph people no, I know. in the foyer. <laughs> once you go and hear him sing, once you go and watch him perform, once you hear him play, you want to hear more of it, like Bing Crosby, like Frank Sinatra, like Boy George, like Sade, like Elton John. Certain people have got it and certain people have had it. You hear them sing, you hear them perform and you say, that I like, I want more of that, that makes me feel real good. My favourite song on the album is All It Takes Is Love. I respond to All It Takes Is Love because it's about giving, it's about understanding the suffering